Hello, this is Andrew Reynolds, and today I'm going to show you how to make a full Windsor knot for your neckties. Go ahead, keep your collars up, your top button button, bring your tie around. Okay, so for the full Windsor, I would uh, typically, with a knot tying for your neckties, you have a certain stitching that is uh, present on uh, whatever's not your dominant side. I keep the bigger portion on my right hand side because I'm right handed, this would be on my left hand side. Typically there's a little bit of stitching at a diagonal level that is where you'd normally cross for most other knots. But if you find that your full Windsor is having a little bit of, of a hard time to keep the bigger portion longer, go ahead and just uh, bring that down about four inches. So for the full Windsor, basically you're going to take your dominant hand and cross it over. I'm right handed, so if you're left handed just reverse all this. Take my right hand, I'm going to cross over, and I'm just going to bring it up through the top here. And what you're doing basically at this point is creating little little sections of bulk on either side that's going to give you a perfect little triangle shape. And so I'm going to cross it over and then this one's going to come from the front and kind of bring it around the right hand side. And you can already start to see a little bit of a V forming right there. This is the basic shape that's going to make the full Windsor look as good as it does. Now we're going to go ahead and cross it over this whole portion here, keep it nice and flat and then bring it up around top. Once again, you're starting to see a really nice triangle forming here. Now this front piece, of course, has a bit of a loop to it, so you want to pull that out just a little bit, and keeping it as flat as you can, take the big portion of your tie and bring it down through. And this is the point when you kind of fix it and kind of hand shape that triangle so that uh, when you get that just the right portion and you and this is looking the way you'd like it, go ahead and pull on the backhand portion of the tie and just center it up. Of course, place your collars down. A very nice, very formal full Windsor knot. Thanks for watching.